Hey everyone, welcome to another logistic gameplay video of Postscriptum. This video is about the defensive side of logistics. I already uploaded a video about logistics on attack, link to that video you can find in the description and in top right corner of your screen right now. Ok, back to this one. Defensive logistics depend on each individual interpretation and inspiration so it can be played in a lot of different ways. Now you can already see first basic rule and that is ammo grade. Build those on objectives so your teammates can use it while defending or at least bring them supplies for it. Second basic rule are fortifications and there are two types of fortifications, weapons and buildings. As you can see this depends on individual inspiration and a bit of anticipation on how are you going to position your building and in which direction will face your MGs. Now, about weapons on defense, there are basically just the MGs that are useful in my opinion, but there are much more choices when it comes to buildings. You can build sandbags, barricades, razor wire, small wall out of logs and sandbags, bunkers, even MG nests and hedgehogs for roadblock. But all those things that I just mentioned can be destroyed, so at the end of the video I'll show you what artillery can do to those buildings and obstacles. Third rule, if you want to call it that way, is just preventing enemy vehicles to see the front and you can do that with laying down some mines. You've got two examples here, one with anti-tank mine and one with anti-personnel mines. Ammo box set, mines are laid and the vehicle is coming. Boom! Did you already get someone? Yeah, it's what was, it was an armored vehicle. No tank. I'm gonna pass over on the eastern side next to... So when enemy does reach your fortified position, just try and make good use of it. Squad 2, just go ahead and go. If you need support. West, I'll have my guys push over. Shot from White House, White House. They're in the White House. Also, keep in mind that this thing that it's going to happen in the next 10 seconds does happen a lot.
OK, here are some fortifications and two MGs, and now you'll see how everything looks like after artillery. Well, Artillery Barrage has done the job and everything that is left here can be rebuilt without using supplies.